can you set up the desk so that the customers can turn it on and off? For sure I can, I said to the project manager and simply build a user interface in the layout view. I created a macro that works like a toggle button. There is a macro hidden behind a button. So I right click in the macro number 2 and then on new. Now I enter the command to start my executor. Now I copy the macro, label it off and change the command. From the percentage of 100 I make now 0%. To make a toggle macro out of these two macros, I add a second program line in macro 2. When I executing the macro, the off macro is now copied to position 1. Macro, th macro 3 I now add a second line that copies macro 2 to position 1. To get around this question, I add a backslash O at the end of the program line 2. The O stands for override. And finish is my toggle macro. Now I'm creating a layout view by storing a free space in the layout view pool. After that I assign my macro there. Now I load into the image pool on position 22 and 23, two icons for these buttons. How to do that, I have already described in another video. So, that the right image is displayed depending on the switch position, I work here with a placeholder. I select line 2 in the macro and click Add to add the necessary copy command for the macros. Important! The image copy command have to be before the macro copy command. After pressing the macro twice, the image is also there and can now be displayed in the layout view. Set up then right click on the macro, visualizing on simple, ID, name and type off and choose the first icon in image. Done is our toggle button. There were still moving lights in the descriptive case that had to be a lamp on. So, for this I programmed two more sequences. One with a lamp on command and the other one with a lamp off. I programmed the second queue, which starts automatically after 10 seconds. In the command line of this queue, I give the command to turn off this sequence then automatically.
I program the command to start these sequences into the on of macros. Important that this is again before the macro copy command. To visualize this now a little nice, I save a new timer on the storage position 2 in the timer pool. With the right click into the timer, I can set the options. I want a countdown with 10 seconds without alarm. I enter the command to start this countdown into the sequences for the lamp on off functions. I'll add the timer to the layout view and open a new view. Here I open my layout view and link the first view. With setup I set the desired positions and the size of the buttons. By clicking on the yellow ball, I have access to the options. Grid to 0, 0, Background, I can turn off the zoom bar behind Tools layer and with the title buttons, I disable all the title buttons the customer does not need. Save the view and done. My name is Fiz and I would be glad if you subscribe my channel. Please write me also in the comments what you like and what I should do better. And please visit my princess on Instagram.